Hey, this is Rick with Sewer 1721. <laughs> what do we have here? Oh, that's an impact. Oh, that's an M3. Uh, this isn't just your any M3. This is the one that has the power block, tungsten hammer, and tension 800 millimeter 22 cal, shooting almost a thousand feet per second. Oh, it'll shoot higher than a thousand, but I tuned it for myself at about 995 to a thousand. Oh, that's kind of not true. I actually had the Utah guys help out with that, so kind of got to give them a lot of credit or else I'll hear about it. But today's video, what we want to do is we want to demonstrate spray paint cans are great reactionary targets. We're going to put one at 100, 200, 300, and 400 yards because 400 behind me out to that grass line, that's 400. That's 400 right at that grass line. And that's, that's going to give us splash. That's going to let us see and uh we'll get to see you know what the wind is doing and stuff like that but the whole reason for this video i want to show you the accuracy of this 800 millimeter tension barrel i, I with the javelins here these 40 grain these are 218s that i'm shooting when i was out in utah this is when this caught on to me that i wanted to make a video like this i'd like to do further but i don't have the distance right now but we'll get there out there i was sitting and i saw a prairie dog and I didn't know the distance but I knew I better jack the scope the whole way so I took this uh, element optics Titan jacked it the whole way <clears throat> cranked it back to eight magnification took four shots and hit a prairie dog at 544 that woke me up inside like you wouldn't believe then the thoughts started coming to me wait a second I just hit a prairie dog which if you look at that can about the same and I thought to myself wow we can shoot that far. We had to hold for wind. There was wind. You can just, if you guys don't believe me, talk to Thane Simmons. He was there. And he knows how much wind was blowing across there. And uh, to hit one at that distance was amazing. And today's video, I'm going to be showing stray lock. And the, the stray lock, how it works as far as once we put that in, <clears throat> the data into my phone on stray lock pro, it just gives you the holdover. And you can shoot anywhere from you know 50 the whole way out to about 370 something like that with just hold over no dialing just hold over just use your hold over give that some thought you in the scope 0 to 50 just use your hold over it's end of story that is something that to me is totally amazing for an air gun that's enough talking let's sit down here and do some shooting all right well here we are with the javelin 218 40 grainers traveling 995 feet per second. We're in our Stray Lock Pro here and we're going to follow this over for MOA and it says hold six and a half. We're going to have to hold a little bit for wind. We got an eight to ten this way. Right now I'd say it's a steady eight so I'm going to hold a little bit and see what happens. I'm going to hold six and a half like it says. Well, I think that was uh, pretty dead on there. Did you see that? All right, now we're going to move into straight lock. Let's see what we got. And 200 is 25. We got to hold 25. And since we're using the Element Optics Titan uh, at 225 MOA, this is what we're using. And uh, we're going to see what 25. Feel that wind getting stronger? I'm going to hold just a little bit Storm, more. Storm's coming. We've got about 15 minutes from what my GPS is telling me. Really? Okay. Yep. 25. There we go. There it is. All right. So there's 200. I feel the rain. It's coming. All right. Let's see what we got for 300. 300, we're going to hold 48. Hey, I want to definitely give a shout out to Midwest Elite Air Guns. Air Gun, my apologies. But they were able to get this mag out to us. And I love how this mag works. Got the little magnet going on here. But this thing's working pretty flawless here and saved a day out in Utah. Uh, I was able to use one of these in Utah. And that's how I found out about them. And I didn't know anything. And I was like... Holy cow, that's nice. Really appreciate you. Wanted to give you a shout out and thank you so much for sending this. That is awesome. Appreciate it. Okay, so 348. Let's see what we It's get. looking like your spray paint's laying down there. Yeah, it's standing down there. See the red tip? The red can out there? 
Is it not the grizzly bear? It's you... past him. Go past him. Go past. Yep. Yep. Oh my goodness, that was so close. All right. Woo! Nice 300. That's awesome. Okay. Now we got four. All right, let me get out there. All right. I'm going to dial a while. Okay. So that would be right at the edge. I, I found yeah, it. Yeah, there's a yellow and a white. A yellow and a white. Yeah. I found them. All right. I'm going to shoot at the yellow one. Go. Oh my. Woo! Nice, <laughs> nice, nice, nice. There we go. 400. You see that? That's awesome. 400. I mean, guys, we're talking 22 cow here. I mean, we're, we're dealing with some headwind now. Now I feel like it's more of a headwind. I'm going to spin the drone around. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Did we learn something today? We learned that these 40 grain javelins are flying with superior accuracy. Take a look at the hits on the cans. They are not side hits or anything. They are wind. We held for wind, and that's what the gun did. It actually held. The BC was beautiful. The Titan and the straight lock and the javelins and the M3 all worked together perfectly today i was super impressed with that one thing that i wanted to mention this whole video was stray lock out to 550 right now because out in utah out to prairie dog palooza with justin jacobson i was able to uh hit a prairie dog at 544 and that's amazing now i had to dial for that but you can dial you can i'm sorry you can actually hold over out to I think 370 yards and then dial a little bit as you get out to 400. Your stray lock will hold because you got 64 minutes in your Titan MOA and it is spot on at 400 yards. We wanted to put this on video because nobody is really, nobody's really seen that yes, 800 millimeter, yes, tension barrel, tungsten hammer, power block. This is what you're getting now. You're getting that kind of accuracy at that kind of distance. To me, that blows my mind. I want to thank Utah Air Guns again for the Prairie Dog Palooza. I really uh, appreciate that. Uh, getting to go out there. I was out there with 68 Whiskey. And speaking of 68 Whiskey, I got Keith. Keith is the one that came to me and said, Hey, why don't we set that up in Stray Lock Pro for you so you can have a lot of fun tomorrow. And, and all the credit to Keith. He set this up. I dialed. I held. It was right on the money, Keith. Really appreciate you. Thank you so much. But there you go. You get to see that you have that kind of accuracy and this kind of win. That's pretty amazing. Titan. You have the M3 with the power block, tension barrel, tungsten hammer, giving you that kind of power. This is Rick with Shooter 1721. Thanks for watching. Hold on, hold on. You're forgetting something. What? Is this, are you talking about the golden shot? Yeah, we gotta, we gotta go farther than four. Oh, so you're not happy with four? I mean, I'm happy with four. I think anyone would be happy with four, but. Well. I mean, we did it, so the logical next step is. I guess what? what? I know why you do this, because you know we're going down to Lethal Air. There you go. And we're go. going down to their hunt, and we know they got 520 because we, we did an awesome shot down there years ago. So we know we could probably, what, see 600 yards? Five, six, easily. Well, we know we'll be over five. We're going for six. All right, all right, all right. We're going for 600 yards. On the, This will be the golden shot is what we'll call it. So we're going to save this can. We're going to have a shot. Oh, I forgot to tell you, Ryan. I did do a shot offhand on a spray paint can at 320. And you know what? We'll show that here at the end of the video. Check it out. This is Rick with Shooter 1721. Thanks for watching. Hey, this is Rick with Shooter 1721. Look what we got here. FX Impact M3. We got the 800 millimeter barrel tensioner on here. 
and we got our Donnie on the end there. We got power block and we got uh, tungsten hammer too. We got 310 yards, well 320 actually, it's 320 spray paint can. It's only 320, but I'm gonna see if I can offhand this. I got four rounds in the gun just for the heck of it at the end of the day. And I know you can't see it out there, but I'm gonna help you see it. And let's see. Make sure I got this. All right, yeah, you can see it there. It's almost in the middle of the screen there, and we should see it pop if we hit it here. So let's see what happens. I'm gonna stand right here. You'll hear the gun going off. I got dialed for uh, 320. So let's see if we can put one on. Last one. That was just to the right. Woo! Last shot. Come on, man. <laughs> Let me throw this down. <laughs> yeah, it took me four. I'm getting old. Uh, let me blow this down a little bit. Well, there you go. It, it's unreal. I mean, it is just unreal to shoot three i mean 320s is kind of like some of the guys utah guys would be like eh but i mean that was offhand 320 on a spray paint can that's pretty cool this is rick with shooter 1721 thanks for watching